Hey, welcome back to Simply Nook. I am Sean, your senior support technician here in the RMA and support department. Today we will be showing you how to format a new drive, assigning its drive letter, and extending the volume. We went ahead and pre-installed the new drive that we will be adding in. We will start by, on our desktop, we will right-click our Windows, our Home button. We will go to Disk Management. It's going to detect the drive for us. It's going to ask us if we want to build a master boot record or just a GPU ID partition table. We're going to go with GPT. We're going to click OK. So once we choose GPT, we're going to have a disk zero unallocated here. What we will do is we're going to right click. We are going to select a new simple volume. It's going to take us to the new simple volume wizard. It's going to set everything up for us. Uh, maximum disk space that is currently allowed. You can set the simple volume size to match the exact same. We will hit next. This will allow us to assign it a specific drive letter. For this instance, we'll go ahead and keep it with drive letter D. We're going to hit next. Format this volume using the following settings. We don't have to change anything here. We'll go ahead and hit next. This is just a brief summary of everything selected. Finish. It is now formatting the drive and assigning that drive letter to it. All right, our drive is now formatted. It has a new volume. If you wanted to shrink the volume or extend the volume, you would select these two options. This one here is for shrinking the volume. So if you wanted to bring it down from 250 gigabytes, you can bring it down to 100 if you wanted, uh, as well as extending. If the drive is not showing all of its volume, you will click this and then you will click next again and it will extend that volume for you. And there we have it. We have added the new drive, assigned it its due letter, and the volume is fully extended and ready for use. Thank you again for choosing Simply Nook.